Hi everyone. I think we'll just wait a few minutes to give people the chance to join. Hi Gordon. I think I did it right. Hi Gordon. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Good. How are you doing today? Good. You look That's nice. Good. I think we're just gonna wait for Steph. Oh, are you I'm wearing we have the same shirt on. Yeah. <laughs> I love blue. Blue's one of my favorite colors. I got my last booster shot yesterday. Oh, you got your booster shot yesterday? Yeah. Oh, how do you feel? Uh sleepy. Sleepy, right? Yeah. That's you okay. too? Uh, I haven't got my fourth one yet. I think I'll get it soon, though. Yeah. I have uh, three vaccines so far. <laughs> yeah. Did yeah. you watch mine on uh, July yesterday? I did. I got a chance to saw. I saw a bit of it. I don't know what happened to the sound. Oh, the sound wasn't working? Yeah. Oh, that's weird. Yeah. It's working today. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I like you. Um... I like um. I like your friends. My friend, I know they're really nice. I like them too. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's good. You know yeah. them? Ah, uh, yeah, we go to the same school. You see them sometimes? Um, I haven't seen them yet, but I'm sure I'll see them soon. <laughs> you see them before? No, I haven't seen them before. No. No, you, not You live yet. in Toronto. Yeah, I do. Yeah. Yeah, me too. That's good. You like Toronto? Yeah, you? Yeah, Toronto's a nice city. I really like it. You're born here? Uh, yeah, I was. Me too. Yeah, that's good. Getting cold out now. I know. I think it's raining a little bit today. Yeah, yesterday it rain raining. It rained yesterday, right? I know. You that's see funny. my Aji Live on Tuesday? Uh, I didn't get a chance to watch Tuesdays. No. What did you guys do on Tuesday? Uh, we did uh, Leafs. Oh, that's fun. Did you have fun with it? Yeah. That's good. Hi, everyone. Hi, Bella. I know her. Hi, Bella. Oh, hi, Bella. From camp. Oh, wow. Shallow Lake. Okay, so I'm going to explain to you I miss you, you Bella. <laughs> I'm going to explain to you guys what we're going to be doing today. How uh, do you know about me on you? Uh, and whenever Steph gets a chance to jump in, uh, she can join. So today we're going to be making Halloween treat jars. Oh, I don't have nothing. Oh, that's okay, Gordon. Yeah. You could just watch and we can talk. Yeah, and... yeah don't worry. So we're going to be making Halloween treat jars today. It looks like this. Uh, and I filled it with some of my favorite candy. Um, and also, too, for this activity, if you don't have a jar, uh, a Ziploc plastic <clears> bag <throat> works just as well. You can use this, too, and you can use markers, and you can color on it or do whatever you like. Uh, so now I'll show you guys what we're going to be needing for the activity today. Uh, so we're going to be using this jar right here, some orange paint. You're going to need a paintbrush. Uh, Brown construction paper or any construction paper you have is fine. Um, and we're going to be using some scissors to cut out the face of the pumpkin. So I think we can get started. And whenever Steph comes, she can join us. Where is she? Uh, I'm not sure. I think she'll join soon. Uh, is this your first year in the bus buddies? It is, yeah. I really like it. I love doing activities with you guys. Yeah? Yeah, it's a lot of fun. You like the people from the office? Yeah, everyone's so nice. Deanna. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead, grab the paint, and pour a little bit of it onto the plate. Yeah, everyone's so sweet. Yeah. What are you doing for Halloween? Pardon? Halloween. Halloween, what am I going to be? Yeah. I'm not sure yet. I haven't no. really given it much thought. I like Halloween. Yeah, me too. Jace is out. Pardon? 
The Blue Jays is out now. I know they're out now. You going to Blue Jay games? Um, I've gone to a couple. Back in the summer, I got to go to one. I work at the games. Oh no way! That's so cool. Do fifty fifty. Yeah. Oh wow! Okay, so we're just gonna take our jar, the we'll paint we did here, and we're gonna go ahead and paint all around it. Do you like the Maple Leafs? Yeah, you. Yeah, I actually I had the chance. I went to a game. Uh, I think last week, last weekend. They won. Yeah, uh, yeah, they won. I think it was three two. Oh, you went with. I went with my uh, my parents and my brother. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of fun. Okay, so now we're just gonna go ahead and paint the jar, just like that. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. You gone I to think... games before? Pardon? You been to games? Uh yeah, I've been to a couple when I was little, when I was younger. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what are you doing for Halloween? I think on Halloween I'm going to be handing out candy. I'm excited for. You bought candies yet? Yeah, I bought a couple. Yeah. Do you have any favorite candies? Uh, rockets. Oh, I love rockets. They're so and yummy. Smarties. And Smarties? Yeah, you? Yeah, look, I have Smarties right here. <laughs> <laughs> So we're just painting our jar. We're going to go all the way around. You don't have to use orange. You can use any color you like. I just thought I would use orange because Halloween's coming up. So yeah. Stephanie forget? Um, I'm not sure. I think she said she was coming. She should be here soon. Sarah, nice lady. Nice yes. girl. <laughs> Sarah's really nice. What are you doing next week? Uh, for my Instagram live? Yeah. Um, I think we're going to be making like desserts. Like, yeah, fun, yeah. easy dessert ideas. Your brother, your mom, and dad know you're doing Angela today? Yeah, they know. What they said? They like it. They think it's an amazing idea. Yeah. Yeah. When I told them, they were really happy. Yeah. Hi, everyone. Hi, everyone. Okay, so we're just. I know, uh, Bella was working at camp. Where oh, I wow. In Stoneville. Oh, that's cool. What are you doing this weekend? Ah, uh, what am I doing this weekend? I think I have a lot of homework I have to do. <laughs> Yeah. I'm going to catch up on some homework and relax. Are you doing anything? Uh, tomorrow I'm going out town to Stratford. Oh, Stratford. That's cool. Uh, see a musical. Oh, nice. Chicago. Oh. Oh, Scarborough? No, Chicago. Oh, okay. Yeah. You know that movie, uh, musical? I haven't. I don't think so. It's lots of dancing, singing too. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so we're almost done painting our jar. If we missed some spots. We're just gonna go back in. Somebody's birthday. Oh, it's someone's birthday. On the weekend. Oh wow. When yours? Ah, uh, my birthday's in May. Yeah. January. When's yours? January. Oh, that's kind of soon. January 17th. Oh, wow. I'll be 50. <gasps> no way. Yeah. That's so cool. I like your life last week. Oh, did you like it? Yeah. No, yeah. week before, right? Pardon? Week before. Yeah, the week before, yeah. <laughs> You I like had it? a lot of fun doing it with you guys. You're nervous? Um, I was a little bit nervous, but once I got on, it was all good. Yeah. I had a lot of fun doing it. Okay, we're just finishing doing our jar. Oh, your birthday is January 16th. Wow. 
You guys have a close birthday. Yeah. <laughs> your oldest in your family? Pardon? Who was born first? You? Uh, my brother. My brother was born first. Yeah? Yeah, he's You have one other. brother? Pardon? You have one brother? Yeah, just one. He's in school. Pardon? He in school today? Um, no, he actually, he works now. Yeah? He works every day, he's super busy. <laughs> yeah, you know working? Uh, I work too, yeah. I work on the days I don't have school. Usually on the weekends I work. Yeah? Yeah. You like uh, school? And... Yeah, I do, I really like it. Oh, you just turned 22, that's cool. Okay, so we're just gonna finish up. Painting, if we missed any spots. When you start, when you have school. Pardon? When days you have school. Um, I'm at school, uh, four, three out of the five days a week. Yeah? Yeah. Not today. Yeah, not today. <laughs> yeah, home. Yeah, today I'm at home. I'm happy to be home today doing this live with you guys. Yeah, by yourself at home. Yeah, so this is what the jar looks like. So we're gonna set it to the side for a few minutes um, and let it dry. Just gonna move it. So while that Steph is drying. Stephanie's hiding. Yeah, is Steph here? Steph? No. Oh, not yet? That's okay. That's all right. Okay, so now we're gonna be doing, we're gonna cut out the pieces we need for the face. So we're just gonna take our brown construction paper. I'm also gonna take a pencil right here. And I'm gonna go ahead and just draw uh, two little triangles that look just like this. Yeah. All right. I think the Maple Leafs are playing. Uh, yeah. Is it tonight, tonight. Or? Yeah, tonight. Oh, tonight, right? Oh, that's cool. You'll watch it? Yeah, I'm gonna watch it. Okay, I'm just drawing my triangles. Who oh, you like on the team? Um, I like all the players. Uh, Matthew, I think Matthews is his name. Yeah. yeah. Matthews is one of my favorite players. Uh, you going again? No, I'm not going again. I would love no. to go. It's a lot of fun. <laughs> you like Raptors, no? Yeah, I like the Raptors. I think the Raptors had their uh, first game the other night. Uh, Yesterday. Yesterday, right? Yeah, it looked like you a watch lot of it? fun. Yeah, I watched a little bit of it. So we're just drawing our they won. triangles. Pardon? They won. Yeah, they won, right? Yeah. Yeah. Is my hand? No, my hand's not dirty. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, now I'm just going to go ahead and do the face. Oh, Stephanie. Oh, is Steph here? No, it's her. her. Okay, we should be drying the mouth of the pumpkin. Hey, Adrian. Oh, here's Stephanie. Is Steph here? Hi, Steph. Is she coming soon? Yeah. Whenever you want to join Steph, just uh, request and I'll accept it. Okay, I'm just drying my fingers. You like Steph? Yeah. Yeah, good summer. Yeah, my summer was good. How was what yours? You good. Uh, I just relaxed. I worked a little bit. Saw some yeah. friends. It went by really fast. Oh, Stephanie said, can you? Oh, yep. Yeah. Sorry. One sec, Steph. I think it worked. Or... Oh, hi, Steph. Hi, Steph. Hi. How are you? I'm good. I just sorry. I was I was just I was just filling out some paperwork for for my volunteering with you guys. I had to I had to refill out the paperwork. Oh no, that's okay. Don't worry. See, because I had to fill out all this all this paperwork. I had to fill out oh. five or six papers. <laughs> yeah. 
Because for best friends can end, so they make you re- refill the volunteer paperwork. So oh, okay. I had to sign my T's and cross dot oh, on my eyes and cross my T's. That way they can <laughs> that way they can come back. Cause I'm like, okay, I'm back. Yeah. So I was just saying, this is what we're doing. Because do let's do back to my boss next week. So I didn't this in during next oh, week already. Oh, soon. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm just on the last paper. I'm just on the last yeah, part of the paper okay. that I just had to fill it out. So what we did so far is we went ahead. So this is what we're doing. This is what it looks like. Uh, then we went ahead and we just painted the jar orange. And now we're just working on doing the face. So we're just drawing it on the brown construction paper and we're going to cut it out now. Actually, we're going to draw two. We're going to do so one for Maybe the side. You. Pardon? Is it my other friend? Oh. <laughs> How's your day going, Steph? Well, me and Michelle just did our 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 preparations for Friday, so we just we just did our whole entire uh, thing that we did type out. So oh, that's good. So we're gonna be ready for you guys for Friday. So I'm yeah. like, oh, we have to get everything done today because everything <laughs> has to be done for tomorrow. <laughs> How are you feeling about it? Um, I'm doing okay. I think I'm pretty yeah. good. Like I think yeah. it's I think it's like I've done my speech before at the virtual conference, so I'm like, like this isn't. Like, this is kind of, like, the same thing. Yeah. <laughs> you guys got this. You'll be good. It's like, because it's, like, it's, like, retraining with all of you guys and, and the YLC members. So you're, like, you're sitting in front of, I'm sitting in front of, I'll be doing in front of Deanna and, and in front of, um, I think, Garrett and Holly. Oh, okay. So it's, like, you're, like, sitting in front of our boss and their bosses. And I'm, like, you're, like, like okay, just sit, be calm. Because yeah. Don't bitch it. <laughs> Like, you'll be good, though. You got Cause, this. Because it's like, cause it's kind of like nerve-wracking where you're sitting in front of, you're on Zoom, but you're sitting, you're kind of on screen with, with, with our boss and their and their boss from, yeah. from BBI, so you're like, okay, don't, okay, just sit, be focused, it, don't bitch it. Yeah, versus you on Zoom on this Friday, this Friday and at Jamie. 1 o'clock, so. Yeah. Hi, Jamie. Okay, so now we just finished, I don't know if you could see, I drew, be able to see. I'm just gonna go ahead and cut out the faces now. <clears throat> Steph, are you excited for Halloween? Um, yeah, I had to go and get my costume on Tuesday. Oh, I'm, I'm a little bit behind. Be? I'm a little bit behind though, because my mom's. I'm like, oh, what about your Halloween costume? I was. I'm like, oh, good thing that you caught me. <laughs> I almost forgot. I wasn't like, like, yeah. I almost forgot about the whole thing. I was like, I would have gone. I would have gone earlier, but I was sick with COVID, so I couldn't. I couldn't go out. So. Oh no way! Yeah, I unfortunately caught. I, I had unfortunately it. I caught had COVID it a few so. weeks ago as well. What and did you? Do you have that nagging cough though? It's like it's so um, annoying. I did have <clears> a cough, <throat> but I had a bit of a sore throat and like a stuffy nose. Yeah, I had yeah. my symptoms were like I had the headache, the fever, and then it was like the sweating. Yeah. It was like it was like and then later on it was like that that nagging, lingering cough. It's like okay, just go away, already. go away already. Yeah, Gordon was telling us he got his uh, it was your fourth one, right, Gordon? Yeah. His fourth vaccine yesterday. I had to go and get my flu shot though, but I didn't wait until I'm fully fully recovered to go and get my flu shot yeah done, so. i think you may have to wait a little bit but yeah until you're all good hey hannah and then we don't get our then we don't get our next one until after christmas so because i got my fourth one and i got my fourth shot in july so it's like yeah and then it's like oh you know until after christmas you know the air is covered child i'm like oh okay like we're after christmas yeah, coming so back and getting wait, back right? oh hi hannah. Hey, hannah. hi hannah i miss you I'm gonna. Okay. I'm gonna go as an nose now. I'm gonna go as an angel, so I'm gonna go and get my costume on Tuesday. So. Oh. You know what? Well, you you're dressing up, Judy. Julia. And I'm, I'm gonna go and get my angel costume on Tuesday though, because. Oh, oh that's cool. Because I was I'm like, because then I can decide. I'm like, well, angel or goddess, like. Oh, goddess those and are angel both kind good of like ideas. the same. Angel and goddess are kind of like the same thing. So I'm like, I'm like, do I want to go back to like? Go back to old uh, old style of like an old an old tale that was told like way time way long time ago. Like, yeah, <laughs> you know, like we were like once. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like Greek Greek mythology, like like Zeus, Hera, and 
Athena and Persephone and and her daughter. Yeah. They're telling like a story from way back when, like most people wouldn't even remember Greek mythology. Like not a lot of people remember those stories. And I'm like, remember when it was like, remember like we were when they were on Earth and they did a whole bunch of things, but then it's like the planets, the planets kind of tell the same story. It's like they tell like a time where where it was like it was like our astrology was kind of tied into that. It's so, like like one person was like person that had that almighty power that, that everyone else kind of like feared like everyone like kind of trembled and I'm like oh, please don't hurt me like <laughs> I, won't, I won't do anything to make you mad and I'm like you think this you think um, you're not gonna make me upset you're not gonna make yeah. me want that so what are we gonna <clears throat> oh we're gonna be putting candies in our jars I'll show you guys the candies when we get to oh, I, think we'll, I think we'll go to the grocery store and get those though too that's okay. Yeah. I need to go with my mom to the superstore and get those candies because I had to I had to clean out the thing in the sink today though. I gotta go and clean that out though too. Oh. I could... Do you have a favorite candy set? Okay, cat and arrow. Yeah, these are good. Smarties though too. Like I I like all the chocolates, but then yeah, I like the candies though too. I was like, like that touch. Like <laughs> <laughs> then it's like when you hit them the little kids with anyone I'm like, say one for me. Yeah. You always want them. <laughs> You're like you're expecting like some of your friends to come to the front doors, and I'm like, come to my house. Like everybody hey, no. come to the tree in my I house. I love Halloween because of the candy. That's my favorite part. <laughs> I'm just seeing like your friends at the front door. They like, come to my house. Every trick or treating, come to my house. Yeah. <laughs> come find me. Yeah. You know where I live. If you take the bus, you can take the bus over to my house. I'll give you candy. <laughs> come to my house. Take the bus over to my house and then I'll give you candy. Come over to my house. Yeah. Really? You can okay, help me. Okay, so we have all our little pieces cut out. We're just waiting for it <clears> to dry a little bit more. Yeah, did you see the new... Oh, did you see... Did I show you my, my mom's new pillows? No, you didn't show us. Oh my god, that's so cool. She sewed oh, these I onto the that. pillows. Wow. Yeah, she she likes to sew, so she sewed these on to our pillows. So. Oh, she sewed that yeah. on? Yeah, it's all sewed on. Oh my gosh, that's so cool! I wish I knew how to do that. Wow. I I want to learn how to sew, but I'm so I'm go ahead I'm and afraid cut of the, the other pricks. Uh, face up. I like I like to I want to learn how to sew, but I'm just afraid of like pricking myself. <laughs> <laughs> how are you, um, Stephanie? How am I? Yeah. I'm right now. I'm in. I'm kind of recovering right now. So I'm how are you, Dad, doing? My dad? Yeah, he's good. Yeah, he's good. Say hi for me. Oh, I will say hi for because everyone tells me to tell hi to my dad. Am I like, him oh, at the music game? <laughs> yeah, yeah. We were watching baseball this other night together on TV. We were watching baseball. Oh wow! We're watching New York and. New York Houston. and Houston, and we watched. Oh yeah, they were on the other night, right? Yeah, yeah we were watching that. So, who you want to win it this year? I don't know it's kind of a tight race. It's like sorry, oh, who you like to win? I don't know. I was really hoping the Blue Jays would win, but did you see that last game? With the well, New York, New York's the closest one to when they lost really, so. and the nine. Yeah, I know. I saw that. Sorry, Steph. What were you saying? Like New York is the closest, the next closest next door neighbor that we have, so it's gonna like, you can cheer yeah. for New York. It's like, New York, we miss you, New York. Yeah, I would like for New York to win, maybe. That's a good because team. New York is like really close to our border, so when we go across, yeah, it's our like it's not even a far drive to New York from here. It's like, it's like a few yeah, hours drive, but you can fly. You can fly into New York, but it's I, I I'm I like flying into New York because it's like you get to go to like Greenwich Greenwich Village and and seeing all those little apartments or whatever, and then like you go around and you see like Broadway yeah. and all that. And I'm like, I don't want to go back. Like, have you you been to New York? I went there before the Twin Towers came down. Oh wow! Like, have you ever seen it in real life? Like, it's like it's so illuminating when you go into the city or like all the lights are on and I'm like, I'm like oh, this feels yeah. like home. Yeah. <laughs> like, you get to you get to see where all the different where all the different books are written about different like where authors write about their their different muses. Like you can see where the where the authors are getting their ideas and I'm like, oh Yeah. Oh, I can see where this is going. <laughs> 
where kind of like their the muse is kind of funny because each muse is different how the author goes about it. It's so like they're writing to like where they like someone. They're like talking about them. It's like I like this person because they're like they're not as easily not as easily um, yeah. like they're they're they keep their secrets inside of of themselves. Then that one person can ultimately bring out that. A part of them that they know they don't want to tell anyone, they don't tell their friends, their family about them, they keep it to themselves. I'm like, I don't want to tell them because I'm scared that I'm going to do something that they think that is, I'm like, I keep my secret. The character kind of keeps their secrets to themselves because they're scared to go home to yeah. friends and families and their, and, and, their, and their friends that they like. And it's like, I don't want to tell you because I feel like you're going to be pulled into this and I can't help you if something happens i can't help you if i yeah. go and tell you this because i feel like we're both being hunted like we're both being hunted for something that i did personally and like i don't want to bring you into this it's because i feel like once you're in this and they don't out like they don't out with us so we're stuck in this whole mystery world like we're all stuck yeah. like i never my do you remember abc's castle like if you ever watch a tv show named castle no, I haven't seen it. Hang on, sorry. I'm just going to go ahead and start gluing down the face of the pumpkin onto the jar. And sorry, Steph, what were you saying? Like, if you ever watch a TV show called Castle on, on ABC, like, uh, she... No, he wrote about his obsession with, um, with the NYPD. Like, he followed oh. along these police, this uh, police officer. Like, he followed her around on her duty or, her, like, during her walk or whatever, like, when she was doing cases or whatever, and, like, this author keeps, like, following her around, it's like, oh, I want to see where you're going, like, I want to see what you do on your case, like, how do you do it, like, how do you, how do you solve it, like, how do you label it, like, what do you, like, like, how do you do, like, homicides, how do you do, like, other causes of, like, how you investigate the case, like, arson, homicide, and all that, and then she's like, like, she's like, why is this guy following me around being so annoying? Like, why is he always at the talk? Like, why is he just, like, be quiet? Like, let me work. Like, let Aww. me, like, you know, like, let, let mm-hmm. me get to work instead of him, like, constantly, like, asking me every few seconds, like, oh, what are you doing? Like, who are you talking to? Like, how do you talk to the witness? Like, how do you guys, like, how do you guys walk around? Like, knowing how to, how do you get to witnesses? Like, how do you talk to them? How do you, how do you case? Like, how do you, how do you know what weapon that you're looking for and she's like god just getting so annoying with so annoyed to the guys like get him out of here like he's talking to me so much and I'm trying to focus and trying to walk and so like, like and her friend her friends her friends Val or Ryan and, and Ocha are Ryan and, and Ocha are kind of like you're kind of like laughing right they think this guy's hilarious like they think he's like they think like they think he's so funny and so like witty or whatever and so, like then they eventually like start Later on in the book, they start this relationship, and and he's like he's he thinks that she's so like gorgeous and yeah, yeah like so secretive that like, she has a murder board in her home and she can't let go of her mom's case and she can't let go and he's like like why can't you let this go and she's like because I can't I won't like I I have to fight for my mom like my mom can't have died for nothing like I had to fight for her because I'm the only one that can speak for her. I've done this all my life, and and I, her, NYPD officer, her, her captain, her captain, saying like I'm like, she's never really been able to let go. Like she's so wrapped into it, and that like she won't let go of it because she's so entwined with it that she just, oh wow, yeah. she just can't see it straight. And like this, there's those people that just can't let go of a little secret thing because they're just I'm like, I'm afraid that if I don't do it then then i'm gonna forget this for the rest of my life like i'm not gonna i'm not gonna be happy like i'm never gonna be happy with my life like i'm never gonna be able to trust another person like i'm not gonna be able to trust the person that i will eventually fall in love with yeah and like he brings her coffee to set like and then he starts bringing her coffee to work because he's like you are the most maddening, challenging, stern for the night I've ever seen my whole life. Like, why won't you just smile? Like, why won't you just smile? It's like, why won't you just smile? It's like, because yeah. I can't. Like, and then, like, eventually, down the line, like, she has a panic attack, and, and he's right there, and he's like, oh, no. you're not going to deal with it alone. Like, I'm not going to let you. It's like, yeah. this thing, and then she eventually tells him her story, like, her secret. She's like, 
okay, fine, like, I'll let you in. Like, I'm wanting, I'm, I want to let you in. Like, I want to know that you're not going to tell anyone else. Like, this is just the thing that we keep just between us two. Like, there's no one else in this whole room that we're allowed to talk to. We're not allowed to tell anyone else because this is just a secret between you and I. Like, I'm not, please don't go and tell anyone else because it's just something that I want to share with just that person because I can't. I don't want I don't want that blob to end up people because I feel like I can't trust them. Yeah. Because we're, they're part of that. Wow. But they're part of the bad guys and, and, and someone comes and, and thinks that I know something and so I'm like, no, I don't want to. I can't. I just yeah. <laughs> I wish I can't. Like I I read I read Richard Castle's books, Heat Heat Rises and the other part of the Heat series and I thought it was like it really spoke to me because it's like sometimes you just there are things that you just can't let go. Mm-hmm. But like you just you just can't like you just can't let go because you're you're scared to let someone right. else in to let them take care of you because they're just even so you pull away because you're thinking like oh this is this is this is gonna harm then good yeah you know what I mean like you just you just can't you in your mind you're like I just can't I just don't want to because. He knows, but then once I let him into my into my life, then he's gonna know every little secret that I have, and he's gonna he's gonna make me laugh and push yeah. my buttons <laughs> at the same time. It's like stop, yeah, like, let's, let me just hold on for a second. Like let me just have my thing for a minute. Yeah, and it's like you just he slowly slowly un, unwinds your thing. It's like, Sweetie, like you want to deal with this alone. It's like, <laughs> but I don't. Like I've been at right. this alone for a long time. Sorry, I just went ahead and I glued the face on one side. Uh, so when you're gluing each piece down, you want to make sh- after you glue it, you want to make sure you hold it for at least ten seconds just to make sure it like sticks and dries. So now I'm gonna go ahead and do the other oh, side. Oh, or you can do that with tissue with orange tissue paper though. Too. Yeah, that's orange a good tissue idea paper. too. Because then it can, I, can be a little bit messy, though, and it can be it can yeah. sometimes get on your fingers. You might want to wear, like, gloves or something when you're doing that. Because I think yeah. tissue paper is a lot more easier than that because sometimes you need to wash your fingers off in the sink. Yeah, and, uh, my fingers aren't too bad right now. There's a little bit of orange paint, but I'll wash those, like, when we're done. And my, my nails are starting to slowly grow out, so I'm going oh. to allow them to grow out now. Yeah. I want to do a French manicure, though, and I'm like, oh, no. I keep letting my fingernails grow out nice and healthy so I can do French manicure. Yeah. Because I've got a wedding to go to next year, so I'm going to keep my, uh... And I told myself, I'm like, I'm not going to trim my nails for right now. Well, I might trim them a little bit if they get too long, but I think I'll let them grow and then I'll, I'll do practice, like, French manicure. Or I'll go and get my I'll get my nails French manicure so I know what they'll, so what they'll look like. Yeah, that's true. That's a good idea. I like I like the different styles. Like you know, when you look online for like wedding nails or whatever, it's like French manicures or something that's not too, not not too bold, but just something that's gonna be yeah, not too wear. Do you have a favorite color you like doing? Um, I have a whole bunch of nail polish. My sister just gave me in my drawer. Oh. <laughs> I just tried the wedding color that she sent that she gave me. That I just tried the wedding the wedding nail polish that she gave me. So I'm gonna try that one. That one on. So we're gonna go ahead and glue the other pieces. I have a blue. I have a blue Essie. I have a blue Essie nail polish. So I'm gonna oh, ride that on and see what it looks like. Because yeah. I, I also like the pink though too. The pink's cute though. Yeah. Nice. When, when did you try it on with your with your nails outgrown a little bit? Then it's like it's easier to yeah just like see it, and then you just do the ends of white. Mm-hmm. I'm like, oh, it looks so perfect. Like I mean, <laughs> I still had to go and get my dress. I just wonder when I had to go and get my dress done though, because I had to go and get that soon. Yeah, you have time. So I, I did think- get my dress. I did get my dress altered though, because it's it's pretty long though. And I yeah, haven't altered yet. that's okay. <laughs> it's like it's down to my it's down to my shoes, but I want to I want to get it I want to get it altered just a little bit so I don't trip. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm like I'm like careful. Yeah. It's a, it's an all green dress for my bridesmaid's dress, but it's like I just that's need pretty. to. And I was just like I just need to get it cut because it's, it's by my shoes. So I want to I'd like to get it like cut. Yeah, thank back you. a little bit. Yeah, okay. No, I'm gonna, like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, 
I might want to get it cut to the knee, though, because I think the knee will be easier to get it cut to the knee because I think it's it's less of a tripping hazard because if I just leave it yeah, you like that and then put, yeah. and then put shoes on them, I'm like, I don't want to rip the material because I don't <laughs> want to have to, like, you know what I mean? You don't want to have to carry a, a, a sewing thing in your, in your, in your like, fur or whatever. So like, oh, I yeah. just sewed the dress <laughs> and, like, I don't need anyone else to see you, but, well, what occurred. So, like, I want to have to, like, and to like lean down to do it, so I'm like kind of you know like put my dress. I don't have to have that worry of ripping, ripping the side of yeah. where it is. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and I do want to get my shoes though. I don't know what matches this green. I don't um, know what matches this green. The jar is almost finished. I'm gonna show you guys soon what it looks like. Um. Yeah. I think I'll make one, I want to make one later, though, because I don't have one with me. Yeah, that's me. okay. I don't know if you were here, Steph, but I was saying you can also use a Ziploc bag if you don't have a jar. And you can, like, use markers and draw on it to the same thing like we did on here. And then you can fill it up with candies, too. I need to go and get tissue paper or something, though, if yeah. I have some. I think, you think you were telling me before, um, you can even fill this up with hot chocolate, right? Ooh, yes. Yeah. You can get that, like, Dollarama, Walmart. Yeah. The entire Harvest Barn. Yeah. Because, you know, a lot of the stores now have it on those side. You know, when you go into the stores, they have them on, like, not, 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 like, some of them have them on the shelves and boxes, but then you can also go. There's other stores at like Harvest Barn that have the, the drink packages. They have them on the side of the. Yeah. On the side things, and you just pick them out of that packet. That oh, yeah, packet they're kind of like thing. on like display to the side, right? Yeah, they're having like they have each little packet, and you can take as many as you want, and you can just buy those ones. Yeah, oh, yeah, that's true. That's a good Sometimes idea. Sometimes they, they have them in boxes, like when you go to Shoppers Drug Mart, yeah, Walmart, yeah. the entire, but then some places they had them on those little side things with all the other packets, so you can just pick as many packets as you need. Yeah. Yeah, white shoes are black shoes are green shoes. Yeah, because my dress is green, but I don't I don't know what kind of shoes match green because it's like it's hard to find anything that matches this green because it's like you don't want to look like a plant. Yeah. You don't want to blend into the grass and I'm like, oh, when you take a photo, like when you take a photo, right? It's like it's harder to take a photo and I'm like, oh, I don't want to like blend into the <laughs> ground and then like I look like a little pineapple. Yeah. Blend into the ground, it's like, I don't know, like a little thing, or, or I used to, they have better, because okay. Murdoch, Murdoch Mysteries, they have those better dresses that they have, like, on Murdoch Mysteries, you can see, like, they have those very other colors that they would have, like, they, those yeah. old style dresses that the ladies would wear, they would wear those big, huge, like, Ones and then they have a corset underneath, so it'd be like it'd be like very those those skirts. No, the dresses or skirts would be very tied in with the shirt, but then it would it go all the way out and around. So it's yeah, like when you wore, but then they'd have those very tight, very tight um heel. What is those old style heels called? They're like very Victorian era look shoes. Like oh, they're very I think tight. I know what you're talking about, yeah. Like they're old Victorian style boots, but they look they look yeah. very tight for your feet. And I'm like, I don't know how you're not being how your feet aren't being squished. I'm sorry, I but I don't know how you're not like walking in the grass and like, oh man, I gotta take these shoes off. They're hurting me. They're giving me blisters. Yeah. I'm walking okay. barefoot in the grass. This is what it looks like. You guys like it, Steph Gordon? Yeah, I yeah. love that. That's so cute. It's a good idea. I was yeah. saying before, you can even like fill up with candy or give it to someone or just keep it like at home and you can eat the candy. <laughs> so I'm gonna not eat guys. so many candies until until like until we get the last minute people at the end of the night and I'm like, wait, yeah. let's so see if there's any more candy. My favorite candy of what I'm gonna be putting in here today. Uh so I really like where to go? I really like Reese's Reese's. So I'm gonna put a couple of those in there. And then also like the Reese's cups. Have you guys tried these before? I can't. Yeah. I can't eat those though because I'm allergic to nuts. So oh I no can't, way! <laughs> I can't eat those. Yeah. Thank you. 
Like I some people have allergies, it. so you don't yeah. need to watch because yeah. a lot of a lot of kids have allergies, so you need to really watch the labels yeah, and stuff. Yeah, especially when you hand out have... candy, you want to make sure that you don't hand out uh, candy like with nuts, just in case, because you don't know what the little kids, right? Well, I just I'm I just tend to ask parents before I do anything. It's like yeah, I always ask do... your parents first. Because I, I'm like even if those even if the kids come to the door, it's ex- it's, it's especially thing because some of them might not have or you know the blue there's blue um there's blue people that are there are blue pumpkins now because of because of people with like autism and and people who are non non verbal with disabilities so they might come to your door so you might not yeah. know whether it, if they don't talk or whatever so it's important to just like just be be very very be very welcoming of those people that have the blue, yeah, the blue Halloween course. buckets that come to your door because they might have like autism. They may not be verbal, so it's important to look out for those people. Yeah, you just always have to be aware, right? So I, I always, I always ask people if they have any allergies to candies or or to yeah, or to that's different a good treats. Idea. Just that I know someone's like lactose intolerant or or they don't yeah have dairy gluten and. Or they're vegetarian, or they might have dietary restrictions, so it's very important to ask before you offer a treat, because some of them might have other, you know, other dietary restrictions that you might not know, and you might have to double-check with them. Like, are you dairy, milk, or or otherwise, or be gluten-free, or whatever, or they're allergic to nuts is very important to ask, just to make sure that, that you don't have anyone that might have an allergic reh or or medical medical bracelet on their on their hand like yeah just to tell you it's like oh just in case right? you want to be careful with that stuff because there's a lot of people that have medical bracelets and and so that says yeah. oh I'm this like please ask before you give because I don't yeah. I don't want someone to be allergic to something it's like okay please like be reassured that I'm gonna ask your parent or whoever you're with yeah before correct. I give it to you because I don't want to cross contaminate with other people. Yeah, so it's, so it's is... hard. It's hard to go out to different like different Halloween events and into restaurants and stuff because you always had to advocate if you have an allergy to say something for you. Ask for that treat and like what's in it. Like, can you make sure it doesn't have any nuts or, yeah, or traces of it? Careful with that. Okay, so I just went ahead and I filled my jar with some of the candy. I got you even. <gasps> oh, I love Smarties though. Smarties, yeah. <laughs> I, think I didn't Gordon's... like the double. I didn't like. I didn't like the gummies so much because I. Uh, I don't know. I, I just like them. And then after a while, so I'm like, yeah. worried about calories all the time. So you turn and be like, oh, I need to stop. <laughs> <laughs> Me and Gordon were saying we really like rockets too. Uh, oh, they're I one of our rockets. favorite candies, right, Gordon? Um, yeah. Yeah. I like rockets or, or the sour. The sour, sour. keys or. Well, sour keys, and there's also like sour yeah. keys, the sour, oh, sour tarts or whatever, those sweet mm-hmm. tarts or whatever. Yeah. All right, guys. So I'm going to go ahead and end the live, but thank you for joining me today. Yeah. Uh, feel free to try this at home. It's a really fun idea. I had fun painting this today with you guys. Um, and I will be back next week with another fun activity to do with you. Uh, thank you to Gordon and Steph for joining us today. Yeah. It's really nice meeting you both finally nice face to meet to you. face. Oh no, see you are you're coming on the one on Friday, right? Uh I'm not sure yet. But yeah, I'll try. For the best for the best part is training on Friday though? I'll try, yeah. I'm gonna see. I think, but good I think luck all you're doing your speech Friday, right? I think we're just doing our introductions and, and we have like our one to three sentences oh, okay, of, of yeah. each thing. Right. So Okay. Yeah, I might have to look out for mine though. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to be too fast. I'm like, like slow yeah. down, slow down. Like, don't, don't talk so fast. Like, sorry. I know. Just remind me if I'm okay. going too fast. You got this. Pardon me. It, it just you guys have to remind Wait. me if I'm going too fast. It's like just like tell me to like. All right, guys. So I'm gonna go ahead and end the live. But thank you for joining yeah. today. Do you guys want to smile? We can all smile and do a thumbs up for the camera. One, two, three. Great. All right. Thanks, guys. See you next week. Bye. Bye.